My name is Neil Jane. I am a team member of Team Gen Z and I'm from Seattle, Washington. If I'm talking to an 11-year-old kid, I would say, imagine that iPhone you had in your pocket. Next time you're feeling sick, you could just touch it to yourself and it'd tell you exactly what you'd have, what little pills to take, and then you'd be feeling better. I think being the youngest team does give us a unique perspective. I think one that um, everyone wants to help us, first of all, but also I think just the way young people think, the way we think is different than the way a lot of the other teams think. Teenagers to 30-year-olds are coming up with all these new innovations. When I heard about the tricorder, that just hit me specifically. I, I think there was just something so interesting about using that phone that I always have in my pocket in such a profound way that can not only affect all the lives of people in our country, but in the third world, it can affect billions of people who just have no access to healthcare. Around here, there's an environment of supporting, but outside, it's kind of hard to say, I'm a teenager and I want to solve a global health problem, and everyone's going to be like, okay, sure, maybe in 10 years you'll go to college and you'll figure something out, but no one really took us seriously, and I think it's nice to actually have such a supportive group of people here, and I think the whole environment is changing to realize that young people are going to be the innovators. Um, of today, not even tomorrow. But I think what's really cool is that the power our device could have on the lives of so many people. So a mother at home doesn't have to worry about her sick newborn crying in the middle of the night, worrying if is sick. She can literally just take out her phone and diagnose him right there and see if she actually needs to go to the doctor or if he's just tired. Or if he's in a village where they just they have never had access to medical care, care to provide diagnoses for some of these world's common diseases because they're called common diseases for a reason. It's just all of these can be diagnosed um, or treated if diagnosed early and I think that's what we're trying to do. Since I'm 16, I'm still in high school and some teachers just blatantly called. They're like, you know what, Neil, if you want to skip school, come up with a more reasonable response to actually um, leave school for these three days and I have to actually take up and show them that I'm part of a tricorder team. Some of my friends still think I'm making up the whole thing. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, nice, nice.